Tonight isn't much comfort for people dealing with damage from last night's storms. We showed you how those storms knocked down so many trees across Metro Atlanta. CBS 46's Brittany Edney is live now to explain how you can tackle tree concerns before they become real problems. Brittany. Yes, yeah, Sean and Thomas, if you want to avoid those costly cleanups later on down the line, then you're going to want to make sure that you're monitoring your tree's health on a constant basis. First thing I saw is I saw carpenter ants coming out of it. Christy Bryant, an arborist at Speaking for Trees, says when trees like this white oak fall during bad weather, it's usually because it was sick. She says homeowners should monitor their trees by taking pictures and tracking abnormalities. Mushrooms are the decayers of the earth. They should not be growing on what you need to be good solid wood. Um, cracks, deformities, hollows. If you have large older trees like these, then get an arborist and consult them every three years. Preventative pruning could have saved a lot of these trees. Most of the trees that came down in the storms had some structural issues. They had some defects that had gone unnoticed. Brian says if a tree does fall, unless it does damage to your house, homeowners insurance won't cover it and don't expect your neighbor to pay the bill if their tree impacts your property. The tree goes across three yards. Each property owner is responsible for what falls in their yard. Removing trees is expensive. The older and heavier, the more green it'll cost you. Sometimes tens of thousands of dollars. Even then, Mother Nature can still wreak havoc. The healthiest, most sturdy tree in the world could come down. Arborists recommend keeping the bottom of your tree clear of any plants like this one has around it, and that's because the base is where the tree reveals some of the damage if it's maybe sick. So you want to keep plants like ivy and other things wrapped around the trees off. So that way you can spot it if you need to address any issues. Reporting live in Atlanta, Brittany Edney, CBS 46 News.